Remember when game engines were all the rage? Well, buckle up, because those days might be over. Welcome to the future of gaming, where game engines are a thing of the past, and AI is calling the shots. So, what's the buzz about Google's latest innovation, Game Engine? Spoiler alert, it's a game changer, literally. Google has whipped up something that could flip the gaming world on its head. A system that ditches traditional game engines in favor of pure, unfiltered AI. But what exactly is this Game Engine? How does it work? And more importantly, is it really the future of gaming? Stick around because we're diving into all that and more today. What is Game Engine? Last year, NVIDIA's CEO Jensen Huang made a bold prediction. In the future, every single pixel in a game will be generated, not rendered. He gave it a five to 10 year timeline. Fast forward just one year and Google's like, hold my coffee, enter Game Engine. The future is now, folks. According to Google, Game Engine is the first game engine powered entirely by a neural model that enables real-time interaction with a complex environment over long trajectories at high quality. Translation? Game Engine is an AI that generates playable gameplay, no traditional game engine needed. We're talking about high-quality interactive gameplay at 20 FPS, all thanks to a diffusion model that predicts each frame. In essence, Google has birthed the first AI capable of fully simulating a video game, complete with graphics and interactivity. Yeah, it's as wild as it sounds. Current capabilities. If you've ever played the 1993 classic Doom, you know how iconic those 90s graphics are. But here's the kicker. What if I told you there's an AI-generated version of Doom? Yep, you heard me right. That pixelated goodness you see, all of it is generated by AI, trained on the data from the original game. So how on earth does this work? Think of Game Engine as an AI image generator like Midjourney or Dolly, but on steroids. Imagine generating 20 images per second. Sounds impossible, right? But here's the twist. Game Engine isn't just spitting out pictures, it's generating an entire playable world in real time. It's like if you were watching a Doom movie, but with the added bonus that you're in control. So Game Engine is actually a combination of two parts, an RL agent that actually learns the game and collects data based on it, and a diffusion model that predicts and generates the next frame in the gameplay. But wait, there's more. A tweet that caught my eye compares this process to how our brains simulate future events using neural networks. Game Engine works similarly, constantly predicting and generating game features. It's like ChatGPT having a non-stop conversation with Midjourney, producing one frame after another. But don't get it twisted, this isn't some basic text-to-game generator. It's far more sophisticated, using a diffusion model trained on countless hours of gameplay footage. To make this work, the AI, specifically a reinforcement learning agent, had to train itself by playing Doom over and over, learning all the game's ins and outs. Then, using Stable Diffusion 1.4, it started generating the next frame of the game. But here's the catch. This creates a passive version of Doom. The real magic happens when this passive generation is turned into a world model, an AI that understands the entire game environment and can predict what's going to happen next. Whether it's a gunshot, an enemy encounter, or a player entering a new room, Game and Gen generates these scenarios in real time. Unlike procedural generation where content is pre-made, Game and Gen develops everything on the fly. Mind blowing, right? The future of gaming. Now let's be real. The leap from traditional game engines to AI-driven systems has the potential to shake up the $200 billion global gaming industry. Imagine no more manually programmed game logic, just AI handling it all. This could slash development time and costs, making game creation faster and cheaper. Sounds like a dream come true, doesn't it? But before we get too excited, let's pump the brakes a little. One user described this AI version of Doom as the most computationally expensive way to run a 30-year-old game. And for a 20 FPS game, that's pretty far from what modern gamers expect. We're used to 60 FPS minimum. So there are two ways to look at this. One is like this user. On one hand, we're in the early stages of something groundbreaking. Sure, 20 FPS isn't great, but watching this technology evolve could be the real thrill. It's like being part of the journey from black and white TV to 4K streaming. On the other hand, remember that line from Jurassic Park, your scientists were so preoccupied with whether or not they could that they didn't stop to think if they should. Some users argue that focusing on running Doom in this way is overkill, like trying to reinvent the wheel with more steps and lower performance. When you put it like that, it does make you wonder if this technology is solving a problem that doesn't really exist, at least not yet. But hey, what do you think? Is this AI-driven future the next big thing or just a fancy experiment? At the end of the day, AI game generation isn't replacing human game developers anytime soon. The tech just isn't there yet. But these advancements are paving the way for something big. We could see shorter development times, lower costs, 
and even entirely new genres of games where the world and gameplay evolve dynamically based on player actions. The potential to reshape the gaming landscape is huge, but for now, all we can do is sit back and watch the future unfold. Other potential applications. And here's where it gets even more exciting. Game Engine's potential extends far beyond gaming. Imagine this technology transforming industries like virtual reality, autonomous vehicles, and smart cities. Any field that requires real-time simulations for training, testing, or operational management. Take autonomous vehicles, for example. They need to simulate countless driving scenarios to safely navigate complex environments. Game Engine could process these environments in real time, ensuring vehicles make the right decisions on the fly. The implications are massive, from fully immersive, interactive worlds to real-time adaptations and changing environments. This tech could revolutionize everything from education and healthcare to remote work, making interactive simulations more effective and engaging than ever before. Even if Game Engine isn't perfect yet, it's one of the most exciting advancements in AI right now. And honestly, I can't wait to see where it goes from here. If you're as pumped about AI and gaming as I am, make sure to give this one a thumbs up, hit subscribe, and tap the notification bell if you haven't yet. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one with more mind-blowing updates.